Yes, indeed. We back at it once again. B Marsh Boxing, another Saturday night. We got Gary Russell, Gary Antonio Russell, excuse me, younger brother of uh, Gary Russell versus former WBA champion at Bantamweight uh, Juan Carlos Payano. Um, this was actually a step up fight for the man Gary Antonio Russell, fighting a, is a, a world champion in his 18th fight. And, you know, this was a good fight, man, for the, five, for the six rounds that lasted. You know, the man Gary Russell, Antonio, he was a taller fighter. But Juan Carlos Payano was determined to get on the inside and make this a scrappy grappling type of fight, you know, because Gary Antonio Russell could have used his jab, his reach, keep the man at the end of his jab and reach. But Juan Carlos Payano is a crafty um, veteran and he was getting on the inside, but he was getting beat up on the inside, you know. He was landing occasional shots here and there. Don't get it twisted, you know. I think Gary Rus Antonio Russell did not respect his power. That's why he felt comfortable fighting with him on the inside. And Gary Antonio Russell was winning with the body shots, digging in, throwing some overhand rights, you know what I'm saying? Just catching the man Payano. But C Payano was catching Gary Antonio Russell while he was pulling out, you know what I mean? He was pulling up with his chin up in the sky, you know what I'm saying? And um, it was a rough and tumble fight for the five, six rounds that lasted. In round five, which was Carlos Payano's best round, he it was an accidental headbutt, and he it busted up his left eye. You know what I mean? He was leaking profusely. By the time round six was about to start, the referees and the doctors, they stopped the fight, and the, it was a technical decision. The scores went, they went to the scorecards, and Gary Antonio Russell wins this fight. You know what I mean? It was a, a accidental headbutt. You know what I'm saying? And, um... A lot of rabbit punching, a lot of inside fighting as far as a lot of clinching, you know what I mean? But, you know, Juan Carlos Payano, like I said, is not going to let this young guy, Gary Antonio Russell, just keep him at the end of his jab and just box him comfortably. He was going to make it rough and rugged, and he actually paid the price by trying to fight a rough and tumble fight because he got was an accidental headbutt, and he got his eye busted up, and, you know, he was doing pretty well, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, he was losing rounds because Gary Antonio Russell's body shot game was on point, you know what I mean? The power punches, which were mostly accumulation of body shots, you know what I'm saying? You know, the the accidental headbutt came in round five. They were grappling on the inside. A lot of separation had to be done by the referee. The man Gary Antonio Russell was throwing body shots, uppercuts to the rib cage, just throwing shoe shot shots to the body. And Juan Carlos Payano was throwing punches, but he was, you know, but Gary Antonio Russell just wasn't respecting his power, you know what I mean? So he wins this fight, clearly, and we'll see what's next for him, you know what I mean? Juan Carlos Payano, unfortunately for him, former world champion, this is his fifth loss. But, you know, he'll be back, he'll be back, you'll see him on your TV screen, you know what I mean? He just got to get some more W's under his belt right about now. Be Marsh Boxing. Leave your thoughts and comments. Let me know what y'all thought about Gary Antonio Russell getting the W via technical decision versus Gary Antonio, I'm sorry, Juan Carlos Piano. All right, be Marsh Boxing. I'm gone. Peace.